Book 6, Secrets of Self-Mastery. A review of the higher dimensional realms, Archangel Michael. Beloved Masters, there has been much discussion about the various dimensions within this universe, especially the third, fourth and fifth dimensions. These are the dimensional frequencies that most affect humanity, for they create the reality in which humankind exists at this time. Make no mistake, every soul on your planet is being affected by the rapid acceleration of the higher vibrational frequencies of God light, which are bombarding the earth at this time. You must be willing to do the work if you are to move forward on the spiral evolution and ascension, for these refined energy patterns of atomatical particles of light will accelerate even more swiftly over these next critical years of transformation. Also, those of you who are the star seed must be able to demonstrate the benefits and the effectiveness of the sacred wisdom teachings that you have integrated and made a part of your core truth. You have agreed to be the way showers and you are sorely needed to guide and assist your soul brothers and sisters. As in the case without messenger, Rona, you will find that as you gain the ability to communicate with the great beings of the higher realms, you will begin to receive information of import from them. However, as you gain access to your sacred mind, you will begin to glean virtual information from your own memory banks. You will discover that as you learn to access your superconscious mind, you will gain the ability to draw forth much wisdom from the past and you will also retain any current teachings more easily. You will also find as you lift and refine your frequency patterns that you have gained the ability to access this information much more readily. Your sacred mind contains advanced levels of consciousness and also the ability to retain and recall data with ease. Third and fourth dimensions. Since humanity's fall in consciousness thousands of years ago, the earth and its physical environment have been composed of third, fourth dimensional components. The third dimensional consists of length, breadth and depth of space. The sentient beings of this dimension are the more evolved animal kingdom, group consciousness and human beings, which have individualized soul consciousness. In the fourth dimension, a consciousness awareness of the now moment is added to length, breadth and depth of space. The fourth dimension is the realm of emotions and the astral plane. Since it is the beginning stage of higher frequency patterns, time is more fluid and the laws of time and space begin to change. It is sometimes called the etheric realm. We must pass through the mass consciousness belief structure, which is mostly comprised of the conglomeration of inharmonious third, fourth dimensional vibrations. It is our responsibility to clear or neutralize our personal discordant vibration frequencies in order to transverse the seven sub levels of the fourth dimensional environment and tap into an awareness of I am within the fifth dimensional environment. Dimensions Subuniversal. Our subuniverse is composed of light, sound, and color, as well as different levels of density. Everything within the subuniverse has resonance, or it is composed of vibrational frequency patterns. Unity consciousness within this subuniverse begins in the fourth dimension, where the illusion of the third and fourth dimensions begin to fade away. The fifth dimension is the true beginning of the ascension process. You begin to prepare for ascension within the vibrational patterns of the, full, the higher fourth dimension as you strive to return to balance and harmony within the physical, mental, emotional and etheric bodies. The higher frequencies dimensions, those of the higher fifth and sixth dimension and above, gradually become more etherical, gosme or crystalline. There is form, however, as you move into the higher sixth dimension and above, form gradually becomes finer, often translucent and sometimes fluid. The dimensions of this sub-universe are arranged accordingly 
to the vibrational frequencies, which means the higher dimensions resonate to the higher, more refined frequencies, and the lower, denser dimensions resonate to the slower vibrational patterns. Each, each dimension is controlled by the universal laws and principles which must be adhered to while resonating within the frequencies of that dimension. There is no firm demarcation between dimensions, for the, they ebb and flow in a wave pattern and interpret it each other to a certain degree. Much of humanity is now resonating to the higher frequencies of higher, more harmonious frequencies of the third dimension, while tapping into and integrating various levels of the fourth dimension. Some dedicated souls are beginning to access some of the frequency patterns of the lower sub-levels of the fifth dimension, and some even more advanced souls are integrating small amounts of six dimensional frequency patterns and even higher via the cities of light. We only have access to the primordial life force substance or half spectrum light while resonating within a third fourth dimensional environment. We must clear 51% of our negative frequency patterns and attune our energetic signature to at least a portion of the lower sublevel frequencies of the fifth dimension in order to re receive the animatical particles of creator light, the full spectrum light for our sub-universe.